नाउ आई एम इंट्रोड्यूसिंग यू अ टॉपिक स्टेटिस्टिक्स इनफैक्ट स्टेटिक्स कंसेप्ट वॉज गिवेन बाय कार्ल पियर्सन दिस स्टेटिक्स वी आर लिसनिंग सॉल्विंग डूइंग सिंस क्लास सिक्स there are various ways and applications of use of the statistics statistics is daily used by the government of india to represent the data it is used for the basic purpose of drawing bar graph and histogram cumulative frequency ogives etc but the big question comes what statistics is so my purpose is to tell you in this that what is statistics and what are the term related to statistics so if i talk first what is the statistics the statistics is the branch of maths which deals with the study of the data now a new question come what is a data data is the if i explain you data data is the numerical information it is the numerical information now question raise what are the numerical informations if i say a is very poor b is very rich c is very intelligent d is very ugly E is very beautiful f is very smart these all informations are not numerical these are qualitative informations and any information which deals with quality only no number no quantity no numerical information cannot make the data so if i say my weight is 60 kg is a numerical information that the rate of growth of some company is 20% 20 is involved that is the definitely data so when we speak anything with some number that information required for some particular study such collection is considered to be data datas are of two type data collected directly from the source is known as the raw data data if a person a salesman is sent to bring the information about the sale of how many lux soaps have been sold on particular soap for particular soap for 30 days of a month so that collection of informations by salesman is a raw data if data is arranged then it is known as the airy data airy data or we can call the secondary data the raw data is also known as the primary data so secondary data or raw data is arranged data if data is arranged either in ascending descending or as per requirement then that is known as the airy data now there is one more term that is known as the range range is highest data highest value minus lowest value what is the highest value minus what is the lowest value this difference is known as the range so we have to remind what is the next information that is the class size what is the class size suppose i say 15 to 30 then 30 to 45 so upper limit minus lower limit and as per exclusive and inclusive informations we obtain the class size then we come what is the class mark what is the class mark it is lower limit plus upper limit upon 